What's up guys? It's Shani with Healing Elements. How is everybody doing out there? Uh, of course, welcome if you have never been to my channel before and if you are a return viewer or a loyal subscriber, all the same. Wishing everybody blessings, a lot of positive healing vibrations and love. This is uh, the newest video that I am adding to the playlist. I have going all about spirit animals. So if in particular within your life you've ever resonated with um, say the stingray spirit animal or any other animal that is within the list, perhaps take a listen and see if any of the symbolic meanings that I go through from my perspective are symbolic and meaningful to you. Of course, if you have never resonated with a specific species or animal as your particular spirit animal, if you would like to just be guided and instinctively pick one of the animals or two, take a listen and see if, of course, anything resonates with you in particular and perhaps you'll find your spirit animal. So guys, this is all about the stingray spirit animal, the stingray spirit. So the stingray spirit is incredibly amazing and is symbolic of strategic moves and you are extremely innately gifted with intellectual ways of traversing through things. So you have this sort of perfected maneuverability that is something incredibly symbolic of the stingray spirit being able to stealthily move and maneuver through any obstacle course. You very much possess a strong belief in avoiding conflict at all costs. So, you know, only if pushed, you budge. So if pushed into conflict, that just cannot inevitably be easily evaded or avoided by your swift maneuverability, you will only become aggressive if threatened. And usually only if threatened physically. You have a very strong knack uh, for remaining calm and standing pridefully defensive, almost like Mr. Miyagi or Danielson doing the crane maneuver in Karate Kid, right? If you know what that is. You possess a stance that evokes pacifism and a peaceful resolve. You prefer definitely, you know, to resolve conflict, hoping to resolve conflict in negotiation fashion rather than with force. You definitely are also able very easily to practice restraint. So self-restraint is one of your main pros and, you know, skills that comes easily to you. You are definitely not easily led or, you know, easily addicted to anything or anyone. You definitely are one who manages to avoid purposely, you know, being addicted to bad habits, bad substances, um, bad circumstances or energy even, you have and possess a great sense of self-control. Uh, the Stingray Spirit also is a very strong symbol of true love and new enriching relationships that are explored and experienced uh, throughout your life. So your spirit, uh, the Stingray Spirit, evokes the importance of creating true love interactions and what that brings to your soul path, your life journey. Um, there is a, you know, warning for those who resonate with the Stingray Spirit to be extremely cautious with what you share about your love life because inevitably with such a gentle and graceful and capable of maneuvering creature such as the Stingray people are going to be jealous and they get jealous of your magnetic qualities time and time again. They often, because of this jealousy, can use information that you have handed to them deliberately to try and hurt you and try to affect perhaps your reputation, definitely with an intention to hurt your feelings as though to soothe theirs, a very dysfunctional, as you know, toxic cycle. So definitely be cautious of what you share. You definitely also um, have a tendency to want to avoid often running away from or hiding at the very least your deep raw emotions. This is something precious to you, sacred, and you rarely 
like to show emotional vulnerability. It is something you are not comfortable with and you definitely don't feel that if you do show vulnerability, it is weakness, but you are just not naturally comfortable with broadcasting your deep down raw emotion. You often can sometimes suppress emotions, especially emotions of grief, mourning, or loss of relationships. You definitely are compelled, you know, rather to heal them, you're compelled to evade and totally bail on even admitting or acknowledging that these emotions exist within you. Very stubborn in that regard. Also, the stingray spirit symbolizes sensitivity and all that it entails. The need for a deep, sensitive internal peace within. So as not to be, you know, injured or injure others insensitively. This is very important to you. You are very, very cautious, very courteous, very careful with your critique or conversation you have with others. You never, ever want others, no matter even if you are close with them or not. You do not want others to be of the opinion that you're being insensitive to their emotions or insensitive in general to any situation. Stingray spirit animal energies are very non-reactive, graceful. Again, being able to avoid such battles by maneuvering out of the way. So often, you know, you could be throughout your life accused of being indifferent or quite aloof. But truly, it is just a preference for you to think on things long and hard prior to reacting at all. Your, you know, calculations you rely on and you deliberate and weigh heavily the pros and cons and then step back before you engage. You really like to also put your maneuverability into decision making. Also, spirit uh, of the stingray has to be careful to balance logical thinking with emotional impulse, particularly because you're so sensitive and emotionally driven. Sometimes, of course, as we all are sometimes keen to do, your intuition can be clouded by just emotion. So there's a difference, and you realize this, that there is a difference between emotions and the actual spirituality and instinctive intuition someone possesses. Also, the stingray spirit carries a message to all of your fellow human beings that leadership is not ever meant to be aggressive, nor is it meant to be oppressive or deficient of love. You believe and you carry this message to everyone around you that the primary guide to a good leader or leadership in general is thinking constantly with compassion and a loving mindset. You know that that brings more abundance to any business or project that you are doing. You definitely are one to preach compassionate caregiving to everyone at all times, never budging, never flinching, never feeling any rage or vengeance toward others. You know, this is done despite any individual's social status or background. You love equally. You promote also and project indefinite, like total kindness as a way of life. You are relatable and you relate often with others willingly in your community. You possess flexibility and temperance in everything you do and flexibility and temperance when dealing with different walks of life. The stingray spirit is very steady also and stable, secure, and very, very sturdy. Almost like a guaranteed fixture, like the you know, ancestral home or the grandparents' home that is a constant, that is a beacon that can always um, be relied upon. It is a guarantee, uh, a guaranteed fixture to be seen. So you represent that to other people. You provide a stability and a guarantee for people. And when people count on you, your efforts definitely seem true to this. And people know that they are 
part of an integral team and that they can rely on you to always be a staple within that team. The stingray spirit is symbolic also of discovery, like a discovery of incredible innate strength. You often try to encourage others also to tap in and dive deep, knowing that you are able to show others the way that they too can go within themselves and pull out incredible amounts of strength when needed. Also, the stingray spirit is symbolic of a team effort recognizing continually the importance of sharing responsibility. So cohesive work with others is something that you do well, you teach that it is important to do, and you are often found in a cohesive group team type of setting your entire life, whether that is your neighbors or your work, um, you know, habitants. It is something that you prefer to do completely almost like a coral reef working everything with its purpose and everything helping the other symbiotic you also possess a very strong inclination to nurture youth so nurturing the world's youth or being yourself a dignified very capable and ever supportive parent you often dedicate much time to rearing your own young and also those of people you know and just those within the community that you gravitate to and are guided to. You possess a perfect blend of discipline along with unconditional love and you realize that you know these two staples can carry you through the toughest times. They are building blocks you feel of that which you teach your children to also carry on to their young. You, uh, if you resonate with stingray, spirit, animal energy, you possess a, a quiet nobility. You often can be considered shy or at least shying away from recognition and acknowledgement. You definitely are not one to be notorious or you do not like to be infamous or the subject of, you know, heavy, hot, heated conversation or, you know, one in the limelight, definitely not a person to boast or be prideful or brag at all. There is a, an elegance that shines through and shows on you when, you know, you are gracefully accepting any kind of recognition. It is almost a humble embarrassment, a very innocent like quality that seems true to the selfless nature and, you know, um, prideless human being that you are. The stingray is for sure extremely empathic. Empathy takes you through your life and you feel each interaction, even with the stranger in the grocery store line, has meaning if you are able to put yourself in another's shoes. You know, you are able to sense all the needs of others, all the expressions and read them accordingly. You are able to really understand, really understand different viewpoints, you know, even if it doesn't come close to ringing true to your truth. You definitely embrace individuality and others' point of view within your quote-unquote tribe, your soul family member. So your quote-unquote tribal members, you know, um, definitely can always count on you to understand their plight. And you are never judgmental, always being merciful, even if someone comes to you and announces that they have wronged someone or something or you, yourself. Definitely ruling with a gentle hand, always mercifully working out any disagreements whatsoever with verbal agreements, encouragement, and positive affirmation rather than negative reinforcement. The stingray spirit prefers to use warnings also. You are very, very, you know, um, almost chameleon-like possessing camouflage in some instances, 
but able to be that which is blending in again not wanting to stick out from the crowd or being in the limelight you're also very good-hearted very good-natured you are one for instance to instantly give up your seat on a bus without blinking um, or you can be even known to you know fly by the seat of your pants impulsively on a given night without notice and you know give up your ticket into a huge venue for someone who maybe felt even just left out of your group or you know someone who is less fortunate or who deserves it someone who is maybe sick um, you're you know someone who does a lot of charity work and loves the kind of foundations like make a wish loves making people happy especially when they are suffering in some regard you're extremely emotionally fragile if you resonate with stingray spirit animal energy so people must handle you with care because too much damage due to this fragility can be done to your sentimental heart you must be treated with consideration and consideration of this you know being ultra sensitive to others you know and their moods and also energies even when passing through crowds is something indicative of the stingray spirit you can become, you know, affected, moody sometimes, you know, and all the while you remain stable, pushing out the desire to unravel or become emotionally unstable due to these energies. So constantly having, you know, empathy, but a mindset knowing that it does no good to perhaps worry incessantly over something that you can't control especially those around you in your work environment maybe that you're not intimate with but no very very tried and true so guys that is all about the stingray spirit animal